Friday, people, let's talk Anchor. So Anchor was pretty busy yesterday. They were at a couple of spaces yesterday giving presentations. Even Chandler Song was on one of them. So yesterday, they, you know, one of them was with Anchor and storage, and they're talking about how infrastructure is doing well. You know, they're, they're glad to both be in that type of industry because even in this bear market, they are doing well. There seems to be a demand for this infrastructure, and they are seeing growth. Both companies are seeing growth. So this is good news because in bear markets, you know, we see price actions aren't doing well, but it's usually the bear markets that starts to eliminate a lot of the scam coins, a lot of the the weak coins, and only those that are strong enough to survive the bear market make it to the next bull run. So it's good news for both companies. Both companies are doing well. Another space was with um, Gregory. Gregory, you know, the main guy of market in that anchor, and he's talking about, hey, 2023, we're going to see an evolution in gaming. We're going to see gaming 2.0, game fight 2.0 coming. So it looks like they have learned from a lot of the stuff that went wrong with game fight previously, and they are building on that, making it better and making it safer and making it, you know, more of an economic business model to come. You know, because one of the critiques that many of the Game 2 studios had about Game 3 was a lot of it turns up into Ponzi schemes, you know, ponzi -nomics was a term that was used and they're like, hey, you know, we really don't want to get involved with that, you know, everything starts off good, then suddenly it dies, you know, because it seems like the focus has shifted in gaming 1.0 in that a lot of these games were really created to just pump the project, but no entertainment value was produced. So all that is about to change in 2023. And it sounds like they were hinting at that gaming studios, big gaming studios are coming on board to game 2.0, to gaming 2.0. So things are looking good and the future's looking bright. And remember, I'm not affiliated with any of these companies. Always do your own due diligence. Until next time, peace out. Safe investing.